Hey everybody, Scott Sprintzer here, DocSports.com. It is our update for Sunday, November 10th, 2019. Free pick coming up in the NFL. We'll get to that before I do get to that. A quick note, if you're not yet a member over at DocSports.com, it's a real cool way to give it a trial run. Click on the link below the video, get set up for a free $60 account. You can use those free 60 bucks on any of my daily packages or anybody else on the roster over at DocSports.com. It's as simple as that. Click on that link below the video, get set up for the free $60 account. Comes with the DocSports sports.com guarantee we're going to try to make it a weekend sweep here with football we hit here yesterday with troy four and one overall turned a little profit there with college football on saturday and uh, we did lose that big play in the nba darn it i mean you look at san antonio they just weren't in it from start to finish you don't see that too much at home for the spurs they were in a good spot i kind of explained it in the analysis they did not play well from start to finish they were not the right side and the celtics took care of business in that game did go four and one overall in college football and again turned a profit there we'll look to do the same on sunday look for a 4-0 sweep a little more than halfway home four plays to go and uh, one of those happens to be our top play of the entire week in seven unit play in the nfl it goes at 1 p.m eastern 10 a.m pacific if you haven't grabbed all four plays in the nfl they're all available one package one purchase still available right now over at docsports.com all right also don't forget nascar going on sunday and i'll have the nascar picks posted by 11 p.m pacific on saturday night so you'll be able to grab them anytime from 11 p.m saturday night pacific time right Right up until race time on Sunday, about five minutes before race time is when I'll be taking them down. Uh, so you got plenty of time to jump on board, and we are on runs of 13 and three with the last 16, about 20 and six going back to the first of May. You got a big play, big matchup going on Sunday's card again, available after 11 p.m. Pacific time on Saturday night. Uh, free pick in just a moment as we do each and every Saturday night going into Sunday. We'd like to get you caught up on the betting report. Don't forget, we update this betting report, ESPN National, every Sunday morning around 1230 Eastern, 930 AM Pacific time. We jump on board, check out an ESPN radio station near you, and uh, we'll update the betting report from the desert, from Las Vegas. But we take a look at Vegas casinos, offshores, the whole shebang. We're not held to one or two books. And uh, so anyway, you'll be able to catch up on all that if you wish around 12 30 p.m eastern time on espn on sunday morning as it stands right now here's what we've got uh, as far as the most tickets on one side and i'm talking about percentages here it's the Kansas City Chiefs who are getting more than 80% of the tickets in their game at Tennessee. Kansas City getting over 80% of the tickets right now. They're laying six, six and a half on the road uh, to the Titans. And as far as the biggest percentage money play thus far, it is on the Rams who are getting about 80% of the money in their road game at Pittsburgh. Rams laying four in this one. They're getting the tickets, over 70% of the tickets, over 80% of the money. Seems like just about everybody is on the Rams. It's not one of our plays that game, the Rams and the Steelers we're staying off that one as far as joe's versus pros nothing huge to report atlanta getting sharp money new orleans getting uh, public money as you would imagine new orleans laying about 13 and a half to atlanta and detroit getting the tickets while the chicago bears are getting uh, more of the respected money the bears laying three there and of course it has been uh, has come out that uh, matthew stafford has been downgraded to questionable uh, for this game he's a little banged up for the detroit lions anyway we'll update all of that and anything new we talked for about 10 minutes with Kevin Winter every uh, Sunday morning, 1230 Eastern, 930 Pacific on ESPN. So check out a location nearest you if you'd like to get caught up on the betting report. All right, again, for Sunday, we'll have NBA college basketball. Uh, that'll be at 1 p.m. Eastern, by the way, for the NBA on Sunday. As far as college basketball is concerned, that'll be at 11.30 a.m. Eastern. And uh, then I, I will have NHL. I've already checked out the board. We'll have at least one NHL play also available 1 p.m. Eastern on Sunday. All right, let's get to it. Uh, the Bills and the Browns are the free pick. And listen, we're going to jump on the Browns here minus the points. A couple of weeks ago, I jumped on the Buffalo, or excuse me, I jumped on the Eagles against the Buffalo Bills as a premium pick and the Eagles blew them right off their own field 31 to 13. I've got no problem at all. You can't find too many chinks in the armor for this Buffalo Bills defense. 
They're really good. They're championship calendar, obviously, on the defensive side. I just don't trust the offense. I mean, I know Josh, Josh Allen has played decent for the most part this year, but he wants to run a little bit too soon. When the pocket starts to break down, I'm not crazy about his accuracy through the air, and I think it's going to hurt him here. So listen, not too many people want to jump on the Cleveland Browns as far as the public is concerned, but we're going to jump on him here. I think they'll be able to uh, make Josh Allen beat them, and he's not been able to show that he can beat teams with his arm too often often in so far his young career. So this is really it for the Browns. It's kind of like do or die now. Must win doesn't, e uh, doesn't equate will win, uh, but I think they come in with some motivation here and get the job done. Thanks to the Bills offense, which isn't up to the level of the Bills defense. We'll play the Cleveland Browns. That'll be our free pick minus the points over Buffalo. You can find two and a halfs out there, the Cleveland Browns on Sunday. It's going to do it for me for Sunday. If you like these videos, click on that thumbs up button. Be sure to subscribe. I'm Scott Sprites or DocSports.com. Let's put Sunday in the win column right back here Monday morning, 5 a.m. Eastern, 2 a.m. Pacific.